Have you ever uploaded a video on YouTube and you expected it to do so well and you go back and check the analytics 30 minutes later and boom, your video flopped? Well, this has happened to me and it's happened to every other creator that's ever existed on YouTube. So I've gone through and analyzed thousands of accounts to try to determine what makes this happen. And in this video, I'm gonna share with you the five things you need to make sure that you're fixing your content because once you begin fixing these, your views, they're gonna skyrocket. In fact, I just helped this small channel go from almost zero subscribers to over 50,000 in just 30 days. And this creator from less than 10 thousand subscribers to over a hundred thousand subscribers in just 30 days and all they did was fix the five things that I'm about to share with you in this video and I guarantee that if you fix these things the same results can happen to you no matter what niche you're in but first I need you to smash that subscribe button if you want to grow quick on YouTube Instagram TikTok or honestly any other social media platform I upload a video every single day about how to grow on social media in addition to that I created a free YouTube growth course you can get it the link in the pinned comment below it's gonna tell you the best time to post right now and the best hashtags to use and even the best tags to be using on YouTube because if you're not doing these things right you're not gonna grow, you're not gonna get the views that you want. What are you waiting for? It's literally 100% free. Just go to the link in the pinned comment below. The first thing that you need to make sure that you're doing your content is you need to begin violating your audience's expectations. I'm not sure if you guys have ever seen it before because I know a lot of you are young, but there's a video going around of Bill Gates drinking water that was made out of crap. You heard that right. It was made out of human feces, it was turned into water, and he drinks it during a TED Talk presentation. You wanna know why he does that? And even went on Jimmy Kimmel and did this also. You wanna know why? Because it breaks the audience's expectation. He was trying to get the point across that most people throughout the world don't have clean drinking water. And I bet the thing that you're trying to get across isn't that sexy either. So guess what you can do? You can break the person's frame, break their expectation, and this is gonna lead to you getting more views. And it doesn't matter what niche you're in. You could do it in Minecraft, you could do it in fitness, you could do it in fashion, you could do it in crypto, it doesn't matter. But you need to begin applying the principle that every single time that you upload a video, you have to try to break people's frames. For example, I started this video telling you that there were five things you needed to fix. I could have told you that there were five things you needed to do, but that wouldn't be as strong because you know that if you fix something, well then things are going to get better. But if I just told you you had to do something that's kind of authoritarian and you wouldn't listen to me. The second thing you need to make sure that you're fixing is you need to actually fix your mindset and you need to understand where your views are coming from. If you're uploading videos about Minecraft, you could get millions of views, you could get tens of millions of views. But if you're uploading videos about a very specific diet, well then you're not gonna be able to get that many views. For example, I helped this creator right here, Healthy Emmy, grow a ton of followers across all of social media. And on YouTube, she hasn't been able to grow that much because she isn't expanding the broad topics. If you go and look at her TikTok or her Instagram, she posts about much more broad things. But here on YouTube, she's very specific because that's where she sells her program and that's where she makes the majority of her money. So she stays super specific on here, which begs the point that I'm trying to make to you. You might not need millions of views. You might only need 10,000 views, 100,000 views a month for you to be able to make a full-time living. So you need to begin to break the frame and question, why do you need 10 million views? Why do you need a million subscribers? In fact, just myself, I was able to make over $50,000 a month on YouTube with only 20,000 subscribers. I think a lot of you need to break your frame and realize that you don't need millions of views to change your life. Literally just 10,000 views can change your life or a thousand views depending on where those views actually come from. And this is going to be shocking to a lot of you guys, but those niches that typically have a lot of views, a lot of those views typically come from a younger demographic that doesn't have a disposable income. If you want to hit people that have a disposable income, getting less views and hitting them harder is probably going to be the best route to go. And I do want to emphasize that this is going to very much depend on the niche that you're in. So you should only be comparing your views to other people within your niche. You shouldn't be comparing yourself to people outside of your niche because they're posting about different content, they have a different audience, they're hitting a different demographic. So you just can't compare apples to oranges. The next thing that I need to make sure you guys are doing in your content, and I see so many small channels messing this up, and it's one of the biggest things that you need to change with your YouTube content right now, is your content is all about yourself. You cannot have it be all about yourself. Your channel can't even be all about yourself. It needs to be about the other people. It needs to be about the audience. Even if you're doing vlogging content or lifestyle content, you say, Rob, but it is all about me. It's not. It's about the escapism that you're giving people. It's about the entertainment that you're giving people. So you need to actually create the content with the viewer in mind. When I'm recording, this video right here, I'm thinking about the one person that I'm gonna help because they're gonna implement these five things and mainly pay attention to the last thing I'm about to share with you because it's by far the most important, but you understand where I'm coming from. I have one person in mind here. I'm not thinking about 10,000 people that might see this video or 100,000 people. I'm just trying to help serve that one person the same way that I would if I was sitting right across from them in the same way that you should. Whether you're doing entertaining content, you 
You just need to be focused on making that one person laugh. Or if you're doing educational content, teaching one person that thing that you're trying to get across, and this is gonna make your content 100 times better because then people are gonna be interested in it. You don't watch David Dobrik's content because you wanna hear all about his life. You watch his content because it's entertaining and it makes you laugh. You need to think about your content the same exact way because once your viewers choose the priority, well, they're gonna reward you with more views. Now, the next two things are gonna be a lot more tactical. And the first one is that if you're uploading long form content, you need to make sure that you're getting over a 10% click through rate. If your click through rate isn't over 10%, well then your thumbnails aren't bright enough, your title isn't good enough, and quite frankly, nobody cares about what you're talking about. And you also need to make sure that you have less text and bigger text. What you need to do, you need to do a search for whatever your title is, and you need to compare your content to the three other titles that are gonna come up. You can use Millinote to do this, or there are tons of other websites that you could simply use to do this. And you need to compare it. In fact, I would send it to people, people that don't know that you upload on YouTube, or maybe send it to somebody else and say, which one of these videos would you click? Which one of these videos interests you? And if they're not clicking on yours, well then what do you think the random people on YouTube are gonna do? They're gonna swipe away from your content. The same exact thing with your shorts content. You need to make sure that 85% of people are watching the video. If more than 15% of people are swiping away, you're not gonna end up getting views on that short. So again, you need to create the video with that in mind. You need to focus on the first three seconds, first five seconds, first 10 seconds. Make sure that that's amazing because if people don't stick around for that, well, there's no chance in hell they're gonna complete the whole video and actually give you the watch time that you need for YouTube to push your content out. Now, if you wanna get guaranteed subscribers on YouTube right now, well, then please keep watching this video because I've got a special offer for you. The opportunity to grow on YouTube and this organic reach that we're currently seeing is not going to last forever. And there are two things holding you back right now. The first one is that you haven't implemented everything that I just shared with you in this video. And the second is that you haven't gotten into my YouTube mentorship program yet, which literally is going to guarantee that I help you get more subscribers on YouTube in the next 30 days, or you get your money back zero questions asked. In fact, the average person that's gone through this program in the last 30 days has gained over 31,000 subscribers. And the lowest amount of subscribers anybody has ever gained is a thousand subscribers if they implement everything that I share with them in this video. If you want results like that, please go to the link in the description below and sign up right now. Because if you're still watching this video, I'm gonna guess that you're above average. So the odds of you getting over 31,000 subscribers in a 30 day period is probably quite high. And if you don't remember, you need a thousand subscribers in order to get monetized on YouTube. So this is a perfect opportunity for you to make more money from YouTube and for you to set yourself up to become a full-time YouTuber. In fact, I'm gonna tell you exactly what to post, when to post, what hashtags use, again, to guarantee that you get more subscribers subscribers on YouTube. If you don't get more subscribers in the next 30 days, I will give you your money back zero questions asked. And it doesn't matter what your background is or what your niche is. This program is designed to help you get more subscribers faster and easier. Ultimately, it's going to get you more subscribers or your money back. This creator just went through it and gained over 100,000 subscribers. This creator, over 150,000 subscribers. And this creator, over 400,000 subscribers. And I want you to be my next success story. And I want you to be the next person that makes a full-time living from YouTube. So please, go to the link in the description below. Sign up right now. You literally have absolutely nothing to lose. You're gonna get more subscribers or you're gonna get your money back. If you're not interested in those two things, please watch the next two videos I put up on the screen because they're the videos YouTube thinks you should watch next. Thank you so much for watching.